Hello, I received my Whistler TRX-1 from Amazon today and let's see what's in the box. Nice small packaging. see what's inside. Digital handheld scanner manual. Scanner itself, that plate, that won't be needing these, and let's see what's inside here. Belt clip, programming cable, and antenna. When I programmed my radio for the 700 megahertz P25 trunk system here where I live at, I had a lot of trouble. The radio was receiving the talk groups that I assigned in there, then it, it was not uh, decoding them. I uh, was attempting to return the radio and I decided to come look at the programming. I looked at it multiple times. Then I came over here to the trunking radio systems and I clicked onto the site. Then I went onto site options and then the trunking tables. I set it to autofill and this a digital site options on. After that I loaded the, uh, updated the scanner via the USB from the computer and it started uh, I started hearing audio from the talk groups, which I wasn't hearing before, so I went ahead and canceled out my return. Um, I'm, I went to a neighboring city that is on the same network system, and I was uh, able to decode them automatically prior to me changing any settings in the computer. Um, this is a uh, a good radio, and I hope it works out well. One of the things that I noticed is that when you program the radio, it is better to turn the radio off while the USB cable is plugged in to the computer and the radio. Um, you turn the radio off and the computer recognizes that it has a um, an SD card in there. It's gonna Your computer may open up a folder stating that there's files. You X that out and you go ahead and you come over here and you copy configuration to scanner memory card. Um, then it will upload your uh, settings to your uh, TRX-1. Uh, that's the way I found out that it works best for programming. Uh, Y'all have a good day.